What's up, folks, and happy Monday to you guys. Hope you guys had a great start to your week, and hopefully your weekend was fantastic, guys. We are back at it here at the Tidal Wave. We got to hop back in, man. We have a lot to do, a lot of cleaning before we can actually get our gas station to where we want it to be, to what we're used to, right? I mean, our gas station back on the mainland was just absolutely fantastic, man. Now we got to get our, our island gas station to that standard, which you all know it is going to take a hot minute, but what's on our side y'all time is on our side man time is always always on our side so let's go ahead and hop back in here guys let's hop back over to the island hopefully volcano homeboy is doing i it's been a minute since we fed him i very likely doubt he's a happy happy camper so my question is man last time that we did play this game some dude rolled up on a boat i mean i guess he didn't really roll up on a boat he motored up on a boat like bro we're closed you can't come to my gas station when we're closed like, no, get out of life. Don't be doing that. Uh, so anyways, let's make sure our gas station is ready to go for anybody who wants to partake in getting some gas. I mean, basically, guys, that's all we have, dude. We have nothing else to offer anybody in this world because all we have is gas. We don't have any merchandise. We don't have any, uh, I guess, extra parts for boats. Like, we literally have absolutely nothing to offer anybody besides a gas old lean. And so my question is, dude, this is this is gonna be probably just the um, I guess the loading, not really loading, but the loading unloading part. This is our warehouse, you know, kind of a kind of a small warehouse actually. Is this our warehouse? Yeah, yeah, it is, isn't it? This this cannot be our warehouse. Like that is freaking tiny. Like where? No, there's no way. I, I I'm 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 seeing things, man. I I remember last time we played this game, we did venture into repairing and getting our warehouse up to par dude if that's it like wait what we're not gonna be able to hold anything in there yeah that's probably gonna be a boat wash or a car wash or a jet ski wash who knows what that's gonna be but you guys remember our warehouse from the other game i guess i mean i mean if i look back at it guys it wasn't it wasn't huge but this is just absolutely tiny I mean, there's, there's not, I guess we can fill up all of this right here. I mean, maybe it's about the same size. I don't really know. I mean, we can probably, oh, here we go. Well, here's like, here's two shelves. We have freaking, we have literally two shelves. What is that? I don't know. All right. Well, cool. Let's go ahead and open up our gas station, guys. We have two shelves and we have nothing, nothing to show for our two shelves because we don't have anything, man. We don't have any any food we don't have any hats we don't have any merchandise we have absolutely nothing give me a freaking life preserver something that i can sell right that would be freaking fantastic so all right guys i don't know what else we can do i mean we can we can clean and clean and clean for days so what i'll do guys is probably come into this game on my own time and just really really clean it up but we'll definitely do a little bit of cleaning as we're playing just to make it look a little bit prettier guys because right now it just does not look up to par man it does not look like a place that i would like to visit when i go to a tropical island because i'd be like yeah man this is a rundown gas station let's go somewhere else that looks more user friendly like not somewhere where i'm gonna get robbed because it's just freaking a disaster what do we say like in the 50s dude this is gonna be nuts this is gonna be like one of those things that takes us so long Oh my gosh, to get used to every single time we play. I hope not at least. There we go, 54. So yeah, if we stand back here, guys, if we stand right back in this area, it's pretty much a consistent 50-ish area. If we go back a little bit farther, we can go back to, looks like probably this is probably the farthest back we can go. You know, 45 ain't going to cut it, guys. 45 is not going to cut it. And it's not exactly easy to continuously get 54. I'm not like, I'm not trying to be funny here and just keep missing. But dude, like to consistently get 54, it is going to take a hot minute. But anyways, guys, I am freaking done with that. That's probably one of the most things that I do dislike thus far about this, this new DLC. It, it, it's that, man. Like, I, I don't want to keep having to feed this freaking volcano. You know, like, what are you, what are you doing? Can I just plug it? plug it with a big old hole or something not a big old hole what do you you can't plug something with a hole and expect it to be plugged bro what are you talking about i mean plug it with a big plug that sounds a lot better all right so my question is guys like we can gas boats up right we can gas boats up but what else can we do what else can we don't have nothing else that we can do we can't put an order in yet what is what are we doing here 
Yes, I, I see. I see. This is a gas pump, and we don't have any customers as of yet. So let's go ahead and go to our computer. Maybe we can order some merchandise or order something, guys, to get it on our shelf. Let's see what we have going on here. All right. Uh, we have two new mail. All right. We already know about the volcano. We already know about the delivery management. We have nothing at all to manage. Go back to the computer, Bill. Uh, delivery products. Here we go. We can get some products, guys. Let's go in and get some soft drinks. We got to really order up. We don't have a lot of money, guys. We have thirteen hundred dollars. It's too bad we couldn't bring over some of the money we we accumulated back on on the mainland. That. Oh shoot. I hear a boat. I hear a boat. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Did I hear? Yep. There's a boat. Hang on, trigger. Hang on, buddy. What's up? Welcome to the uh, Island of Gas. I don't really know what we're going to call this. And boom. Oh, shoot. I'm sorry, man. I got to turn the volume up, guys. These guys are talking incredibly soft again. So, yeah, man. It's going to take me a minute to get used to these these folks. Because last time we were doing this, guys, we were just mainly messing with the... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Messing with... What am I looking for? There's no dialogue. Oh, boy. Yeah, we're right here. Messing with the uh, planes. We never really actually pump gas. You know what I'm saying? We have not pumped gas into a car in ages. We had customers, not customers. We had actual employees do that for us. So this is going back to square one, man. This is going to be like back to the original days of gas station simulator where we got to run with everything. So let's just go ahead and put a small order in, guys. I mean, not small. But basically, get the necessities, you know, the, the junk food, the alcohols. Oh, we can't. So we're just at level one, which makes it a little bit easier. So what's the damage here, guys? We are at $244, and we have... We have... Oh, shit. I didn't mean to take stuff off. Crap. Uh, oh, I was sitting wrong. But I wasn't, I wasn't paying attention. I was looking down here. So is that too much? Yeah, so we can barely, barely get anything, man. So let's go ahead and head back, guys. What are we missing? We're missing that, and I think we are missing... I think that's about it. I thought I took two things out of there. I'm not exactly sure, but we're going to... Oh, no, dude. We're like... We can't even do that. We have 200, man. Our capacity is 200. That is the smallest freaking... I told you, I told you guys, that warehouse is incredibly small. We have another freaking customer here at the gas pumps let's see if we can make a happy happy customer hello welcome to the is that a per okay there he is i'm like there's nobody there there's nobody driving the boat it looks like a bobber there we go task complete 100 percent what's up so we don't have a lot of room to expand where are we going to put more gas pumps we have one unless we're going to at some point like actually build more docks or maybe this becomes a dock i don't know guys man i mean the futures the futures unknown at this point because this is all new you know at least with the original gas station we had the idea or we had a idea of what we could do because we can clearly see it you know we can see the three or four pumps i think we i think we had three pumps we can see the three pumps right there here it's it's a it's a mystery which i kind of like you know what i'm saying like i i, I want to not know everything it's kind of cool having having the unknown so you can come into the game one day and boom you have another i guess dock for a freaking uh gas pump that would be ideal this is gonna, oh, this is gonna get annoying trying to get 54 every single time it does not want to happen very easily we're stuck at about 45 ish 45 to 60 seems to be our pretty adequate numbers here or our pretty consistent numbers all right come on 54 well 50 we're getting closer Getting closer, we have a boat at... There we, there we go. We got one in at least. I mean, I was at 57, guys, but I'll take it, man. As long as the volcano is happy, it is what it is. And I don't want to make it upset, guys. I know I could let it go and let it go and let it go, but I don't want to get to that point where I get too busy and I forget about it and the thing blows up and we lose everything. I'm assuming we're probably going to lose a lot if that thing does happen to... Uh, to erupt so is everybody here that comes to the island uh, are they all scuba divers we not have anybody driving like a fishing boat or i don't know what jet ski it's like all scuba divers for some odd reason all right guys here is our first our first order what's up bro now my question is i wonder where these guys come from you know how i always question where 
the folks on the, on the actual mainland come from as far as the warehouse you know where is the warehouse at like these guys are coming from boat man and it gotta be somewhat close because those are not very big boats and the ocean can be a very very scary and very dangerous place if you're driving a little tonka truck boat bro you're not gonna make it very far when the waves become 20 to 30 feet they're going to kill you it's just a matter of fact that's just what's gonna happen all right so what is our our goal here our goal is to buy a parking lot you can find the parking lot oh we got a jet ski what's up our first actual customer that is not a freaking boat what's up homie but you're still wearing the same type of outfit <laughs> Why does everybody have a wetsuit on? I mean, I guess it is cold, but like... Whoa, super. Yeah, super. Oh, dude, you just sprayed me, ass. What the hell was that about, man? It's got me so wet. Um, yeah, anyways, all right, let's go here. Go here. Go in here, not in there. Let's go back over here, guys. Let's go and see if we can buy a parking lot. I mean, we have a freaking ton and ton of room so that's my other question dude are we not going to gas up cars anymore are we just strictly boats and jet skis and tugboats and ships and whatever else comes in so that's gonna be a little sketchy bro like if you're here and you're running out of gas i'm gonna be like sorry i ain't got no gas pumps uh you know what i'm saying i got no gas pumps all right we get this for free that is pretty bodacious. I do dig that. A little tiny parking lot, guys. Parking lot number two is not even in the realm of things that we can actually get right now. Shelves. We can get shelves later on in life. All right. Let's see. We have nothing we can do here, guys. Everything is at level two. Uh, products and fuel supply. We are doing halfway decent, guys. Let's go ahead and go out here and gas up another boat so yeah this is gonna get busy man because this is a little bit more of a distance to get to the gas pumps than we had at our gas station there on the mainland what up homie y'all got the same boats all right catch up in oh take me with you oh i was hoping i can get a free ride oh great we're gonna get booted back because i don't remember how to get back up there which I guess is not a bad thing because it allows me to get on shore. We got the police. You guys are coming all the way from the desert. What's up, officer? Hey, how's George doing? Have you talked to George? Huh? Is he doing okay? Tell him I said hi. All right. Yeah, tell him I said, what's up, George? All right. So we... What the hell? We don't have anything. Oh, man. Hang on. Dude, we got to buy a shelf, right? Oh, I don't have a tablet. <laughs> Oh, man. Hang on, officer. Hang on, officer. I don't have anything. I got to buy shelves. Where's my shelves? Oh, uh, let's go get the big guy. And big guy. All right. We got, hang on. Hang on. I'm doing this. I'm going as fast as I can. Grab. Grab the shelf. Turn the shelf. Turn said shelf. Yes, he is stuck. Perfect. Hopefully, he stays stuck for a hot minute. All right. We can put the... Dude, these are a little bit too big for this tiny, tiny room. So this is going to be interesting, man. This is going to be interesting because this is so much different than what we had before. I feel like we have no room in this gas station. And I can't even put this anywhere. So we're going to go ahead and probably just put it right here. Jeez Louise, Batman. Like, this is, this is like in the middle of everything. Hang on, guys. I'll fix that in a second. We got a boat we got to take care of. I don't like being busy. I need employees, man. I, I, I'm so, like, used to having employees, and now I gotta have to do everything myself. It's just like, I don't know what's going on. Stop rocking! <laughs> oh my goodness, dude. That is not easy sometimes. What, what do you say? Sup? All right, let's go back in here, guys, and see if we can get this somewhat more rearranged properly. See what I'm saying, man? Like, maybe because this is back here, we can't put it against the wall. I'm not exactly sure. Get get out all right so the cops leave and he's like there's nothing here for me no there isn't dude i didn't realize i didn't have any shelves that is oh no come here i don't want to litter oh gosh that was the farthest jump in the world where did it go there it is we are not the litter bugs oh jesus we got to get a garbage guy here because that is extremely extremely full all right guys let's go ahead and see if we can put stuff back here now because before I couldn't get it against the wall because of that one little thing. So let's see if this works. Put this right back here as far as we can. Looks like this is probably going to be it for us right about there, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and turn the shelf. We're going to grab this bad boy. Just like that. 
Gonna grab him, gonna go ahead and turn this. So we're gonna have to do a lot of rearranging eventually, guys. But right now, we just gotta get some products on the shelves so people start buying things. And we still can't go as far back as I want. Let's do, let's do that. That looks pretty good, guys. All right, let's go ahead and put uh, 10. Let's put everything on here because these are massive, massive shelves. We probably should have started with a little tiny shelf. But you all know how it goes, man. Eventually, we're going to get up to the point where we have too much crap, you know? We have too much stuff in our shelves. We're going to want to have a bigger shelf, and we don't have that already. What's the point? So let's just go ahead and stock up now with that. We got to get a garbage guy here. Oh, man, we got to go run the cash register, dude. This is so much different. Like, I feel like a, a rook. You know, we're doing everything. All right, guys, let's go ahead to services, garbage collection, get that picked up and ordered. Hello, welcome to the island of whatever we are. Do you have anything? Oh, this is going to take a minute to get used to. I don't remember. I mean, I kind of remember, guys, but, like, we have not done this since, like, week, week one or two. Like, we have not done this in a very, very long time. Oh, George, what's up, buddy? You're back here. I appreciate you. Where are you going, man? You're not gonna buy anything, George? Where are you going? Come back. Oh man, he was he was here. Hey, go tell your son I said hi. Yeah, you are the same exact character as before. Do we have a boat? We do have a customer at the boat in uh, slip or whatever you want to call it. Yeah, this is gonna take a lot of time to get used to, man. You know, we had it so good at the gas station at the mainland it's like i want to go back to that i want to have four or six employees eight employees whatever we had and i want them to run the show i don't want to have to do anything but what we, what we did before stock shelves and make sure everything's running a okay that's all they want to do this stuff is oh <clears throat> oh look at that guys that landed right on the brim hey come back what'd you do forget your wallet cool come on in i got plenty of stuff you know, I just wonder what the comparison is with the gas station we had before as far as size, right? As far as size. And I have to remember that we were at the very, very end of our of our gas station life. So our gas station then, or back on the mainland, was, was huge. We expanded it so many times, like four or five times, to make it as big as it is now. And I don't remember, guys, because it was so long ago, how small it was how small it was when we first started I, I i can't i can't for the life of me think about that because it's or i'll remember that because it was so freaking long ago i mean we're talking about a year you know i have to check the date on the first time we actually played gas station god damn it gas station simulator dude it's been a hot minute and we've been waiting we took some time off guys we took a couple weeks off here and there as we progressively gotten towards the end of this because it was getting to be the same thing i mean this is this is relatively the same thing but it's still different because obviously it's a completely different different uh scenery you know running island here and we don't we don't have the same the same responsibilities we have yes the filling up the of the boats and jet skis and stuff like that but i we don't have the cars we don't have any of that nonsense so again I, it kind of makes me wonder is that if that's going to come into play at some point where we actually do have to get gas pumps for vehicles or are we just strictly Strictly boats and jet skis, you know, I mean, I, I don't know, but either way guys Let's go ahead and back in here because we probably have some customers and We definitely don't so what we do have to do eventually is buy a broom Because our place is going to get dirty and I don't really remember how To buy a broom. I don't know. There we go 50 bucks uh, a broom and Do we not have a freaking garbage can here? Yes, we do right there. Why did I just buy a garbage bag? Oh, man, we're going back to this. And one thing, guys, you know, one thing I wish this game kind of incorporated is if we're the same character or maybe we're a different character. I don't know. But if we are the same character, we're the same guy that owns our other gas station. Why can't I bring that stuff here? Why can't I bring my awesome garbage picker upper state of the art alien type gun that i can shoot and clean up garbage very very easily why do i gotta resort back to having a broom i i mean if i'm buying a gas station on an island i've got to have a little bit of money right i gotta have a little bit of money and i could probably afford something other than a 50 dollar standard kmart broom i mean that's just that's just me what's up buddy Great job. Jeez, you just look freaky as hell. Great job on using 
the get the uh, garbage can same to you girl great job man you guys are freaking fantastic so yeah hopefully it does not rain here guys because we have a lot of holes in our ceiling the place is gonna get wet i'm gonna come to work someday and it's gonna be freaking moldy and wet and like puddles everywhere it's just not gonna be good for business man it's not going to be good thank you sir come back or bring your jet ski bring a boat bring a friend bring a dog i don't care what you bring what's up girlfriend what you got here? What you got for us? All right, let's go ahead and get her her ores, sodas. Clearly, she likes her ores, sodas. Yeah, you owe me exactly what you owe me. I don't know what the total was, but that's what you owe me. I mean, if you want to give me a tip, girl, I don't give a crap. Give me a tip, man. Hook me up. Hook a brother up. All right. I would try to jump out there and ride in this boat, but I can already guarantee what's going to happen, guys. We're going to get a kickback. We're not going to go very far, but... I've said this time and time again, man. I wish we had the option to explore. Like, I would love to have our own boat. Oh, man, I just fell off. I did not mean to. Our own boat or jet ski or canoe or whatever and drive around, man. That would be so much fun just to drive around and explore everything that this island has to offer. I think that would be pretty, pretty sweet. It's a good picture right there. You got our little our torches going. Nice uh, blue starry sky. I don't know what is going on with that. Well, I guess it is 9.30 at night. 9.30 game time. Oh, so our challenge is, is to serve five customers. We're almost there, man. Almost there. We have nobody else in here. Somebody left a banana. <laughs> Again, not sure who, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and take care of the banana. Oh, that's right. We use the garbage bags for picking up garbage. You see, guys, how long it's been, dude. It's been so long since we've done anything remotely close to this type of work. Do we have a bathroom here? I didn't see a bathroom anywhere. So if you have to use the bathroom, guys, do not come to our gas station because you're going to leave still having to use the bathroom. We don't have any bathrooms. We don't believe in bathrooms, evidently. We just believe in doing whatever we're doing here, guys. Maybe one of these are an outhouse. Or maybe the lake, I don't know, or the ocean, whatever you want to call that. I mean, this could, this could be a bathroom or a repair shop. Yeah, it makes me wonder, man, are we going to have a repair shop? This could be, this is an old car wash, clearly. So we're going to have a car wash, that's obvious. All right, all right, so we're going to have kind of the same, same stuff we had before. Car wash, we have our makeshift uh dock or not dock but a warehouse down there we're gonna have a repair shop probably guarantee it at some point in time so yeah we're just gonna have to, we're, we're basically starting over on the island nothing that we did on the mainland is gonna come with us it's all brand brand new which is perfectly fine awesome. absolutely perfectly fine so let's go back inside here guys we have to serve one more customer and then the challenge of the day is done what's up guys welcome to the Island gas station. I don't know what to call this place. All right, task complete. Salute to you, brother. Have a good day. Drive safe. Watch out for the cops. Hey, officer, how are you doing tonight, sir? What can I do for you? What can I do for you? What can I get for you? What did you buy? I don't know. You bought an orange soda. You bought a makeshift Pepsi. Another makeshift Pepsi. And a bag of popcorn. Another bag of popcorn. You like your Super. dual items, huh? You had two Pepsis, two popcorns, and a smelly, smelly garbage can. I will definitely take care of that. Whoa. Oh. Dude, I just rubbed my dirty garbage on that cop's nose. He is going to be smelling that for the rest of his life. That was absolutely disgusting. Go and take care of this. Yeah, so as we're kind of playing, guys, we're going to definitely keep cleaning up, man. That way we can uh, have a beautiful, beautiful island gas station. Do we have anybody here at the gas pumps? Do we do have somebody rolling in now, nah, man? These folks are very, very consistent. You know, I don't see any boats out there, but they're coming from somewhere, and they are coming hot and heavy. Let's go ahead and probably order up some more gas, guys. I'm assuming we're getting somewhat low. How much money do we have? We have $1,000. That's it. Man, I remember looking up there, guys, seeing $100,000, seeing $110,000 just living life to the fullest and now we're like a thousand dollars all right guys what can we do here let's go ahead and upgrade something what can we upgrade okay so we're gonna have a two pump gas station we have toilets guys we have an employee trailer so we're gonna get our first freaking employee are you kidding me there we go that's what i'm saying so we're gonna have maybe maybe cars are going to be gas now that is so incredibly loud 
Hey, hey, you're welcome. So glad I can make you happy, Volcano. It's all about you. It's all about you. Just don't, don't blow me up if I don't feed you. Don't forget about me, right? Don't forget about me because I am uh, trying to do my best. All right, guys, let's go ahead and check our upgrades, see exactly what we got. I know the gas is low. I was trying to order gas. Let's go ahead and get delivery. Let's go ahead and get fuel. Let's do 500 and let's order what we can, guys. Looks like we're going to order. I don't know. I don't know. All right, we have a boat that is arriving, or is that a car? I don't know what's going on. I'm going to get confused. All right, yeah, so we are definitely going to have probably gas stations up here. What is that? I don't know. what that, I don't know what's going on there, man. It looks like a sandbox. Maybe we're going to build a sandbox for the kids. They can play under there or something. Not exactly sure, guys, but only time will tell. Let's go ahead and get this guy gassed up, but that is going to get extremely, extremely busy, guys. If we have a freaking... Gas station up front, a gas station in the back, and just me. But we do have seven hundred and eleven dollars. Let's go ahead and see if we can hire hire an employee. Uh, we have more parking, so parking number two is a gas pump, guys. We're gonna go ahead and buy that though. Uh, I should not have done it actually, but hey, hang on. Let's see if we can get an employee real quick. So we do have an employee trailer. Hang on, sir. I actually, actually, I will help you out, sir. Thank you for coming to the island of. I don't know, gas. The island of gas. The coconut gas station. You are getting lots and lots of treats for tonight. All right, buddy, take care of yourself. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can hire one employee. We do have a trailer, guys. We're going to hire nobody. Buy at least one trailer. I thought we did. $400, not much, guys. That is going to take up a lot of our money, though, because we had like 700 then we bought something else, and now we're down to whatever we have. So we don't have... We have $70. <laughs> All right. Well, we know this guy's legit. We're going to hire him. Cool. Let's go ahead and take care of... Oh, officer, what's up? You scared the living hell out of me? All right, yeah, so we do have... We, yeah, we have a gas pump in the back and a gas pump in the front. It's going to be freaking busy as shiznit. All right, let's go ahead and take care of this guy first. And then, so my question is, my question is, man, where do we want our employee, man? Uh, I don't know. Maybe have our employee work the register. Doesn't seem like it's super busy at this particular moment, but I got to imagine, guys, it is probably going to get a lot more busier as the time goes by. You know what I'm saying? I can see that totally happening. You're, you're not. You're a cop. Dude. Cops, you can't get stranded. You got a radio, bro. All right. So let's go ahead he is resting. Let's have him work. So we're gonna have ice cream too. All right, we got. Let's have him work. Um, I would say maybe the register. I don't know. It just doesn't seem that busy. But oh, hi. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I didn't see you standing there. You should have like said something. Like hey. Or, excuse me, sir, I'd like to buy my 15 things of ho-hos or whatever those things are. All right. Well, I don't know what that guy's doing or my employee. This is a, is it 4 o'clock in the morning? I think it is. So he is resting. Where are their houses at? Where are their houses? And our thing is going down. I don't know if 2 is a good thing or if that's a bad thing. Let's check it out. Let's see what happens when we throw this in here at 54. Oh, we are so close, but yet so incredibly far away. 61, not going to happen. Let's go back here and try this again. 48. Oh, my gosh, guys. I'm telling you what. 54. Right on the money. All right. It looks like these are our bathrooms. <laughs> oh, yes. These are probably our bath. Oh, come here. Let's go inside here and check, check these out. Are these? What? It's a massage table. What? We have a massage table, or is this, is this their bed? <laughs> I don't wait. Oh, this is your room. My bad. I thought that was a massage table. I was like, hell, yeah. Now we're gonna make some killer money. Uh, that is not. That is where they they stay. Are my employees? Dude, I would love. Well, actually, I don't know. Let me take that back because that looks like it's uh, like no no electricity, no heat. No fans, nothing. You're just in a hut. You're in a hut, and that's it. Bugs, probably monkeys getting there, animals, 
crazy animals, crazy people. I don't know, man. I don't know if I dig that or not. I don't know. Grab it. Just as I wanted. All right. So what time is it? It is six o'clock in the morning. What time does our employee start? He starts at eight o'clock. So we got him handling this for the day shift, which should be right around the corner, guys. Let's go ahead and take care of this boat. We are getting very, very low on fuel. But I want to say we do have a fuel truck that is here. It is a jet ski. It should not take that much fuel. I don't know, man. We're, we're, we were just under the nozzle there. So let's go ahead and get this uh, taken care of, guys. Get our gas pumped into our system here. What's up? Thank you for coming, sir. All right, guys. We're good to go there. Let's head back out here. So what time is it now? It is 630, guys. We have hopefully homeboy starting here. If I can speak, starting soon. So where are our bathrooms? I know I said we got one toilet. I'm kind of curious, and I'm not exactly sure why, but I'm just kind of curious on where everything is, man. You know, because here is here's our layout. Here is our actual gas station. We do have somebody here. This is going to get freaking weird. Maybe the people take a piss in there. I don't really know. What's up? So first thing that I am, I am going to do, guys, when I get a couple more dollars, is probably hire a second employee just to make things run more efficiently because right now it is definitely not man i am all over the map my dude is getting so many freaking steps in today he's rolling with like fifty thousand every six hours man that's how many steps my guy is getting all of the time still not seeing a bathroom i know that said toilet so maybe there's just one somewhere hidden not exactly sure but it's probably something we should know about because we're gonna have to clean it at some point in time but again, you guys see what I see? Nothing. All right, let's head back here. Get this guy gassed on up. There you go, sir. Thank you. Come again. And let's keep exploring. Maybe there's a bathroom out here, which would be a very long distance to walk as a customer. Wait a minute. Hang on. Where the hell's my house? You guys know how on the other... On our mainland gas station, we had a house. We don't have one now, so we don't get to. We don't sleep. We're just up, twenty four seven. That would be the most uncomfortable bed in the world. I would never sleep. I I would be up for forever. Like there's not even days or hours. I would literally be up forever. That's wood, bamboo, whatever you want to call it. All right, let's go ahead and explore, guys. We have a few cars here, but I'm, I'm not seeing a house for me, and I'm not seeing a, a bathroom, which is fine. It is what it is. I'm going, I guess I'm done looking because we don't have that stuff. Um, but, yeah, so we're going to have a car wash here in a little, little bit. It's going to take some time. So we have Homeboy working the cash register. We're going to have to order some food here pretty, pretty soon, man, because I know we're getting low on that because we have two shelves. We have two shelves, and, they're not, you know, we don't stock them up fully yet because we don't have a lot of money we're at 273 dollars guys but i'm telling you man my dude is getting a effing workout dude like he is for real getting a effing workout there you go all right i'm not sure what that's for let's go back over here check out this uh warehouse see how things are doing over here we should put an order in for a little bit of a it's a little bit of product but i don't know man we don't have enough money we'll wait till we get to uh close to a thousand dollars we'll probably be empty probably have everything sold by the time we get to a thousand dollars i mean maybe with you know the the gas revenue we probably get to a thousand dollars pretty quickly with that but as far as this stuff like man stuff people are gonna buy that stuff like it's going out of style i'm gonna buy it very very quickly but i'm kind of surprised though guys that they didn't like put more food in for you know maybe the later levels for like a tropical theme no this is the same stuff we had before this is the same stuff at the other gas station. I mean, which is fine. It, it is what it is. It's very minor, minor details. Um, but yeah, I would like to see, you know, different types of, uh, I guess, island-related food for these folks. But, hey, it is what it is. All right. Is this the outhouse? Customer parking. Uh, gas station. The old tugboat. Yeah, man. So we're looking at, uh, you, if you need to use the bathroom, guys, go ahead and take a squat in the woods here. Or... That's about it. No other place to go. So we're going to have a workshop too, guys. Looks like we're going to have everything that we had before. Minus a house for myself. We are still missing that huge, huge thing. Because I need to sleep at some point. 
How you doing, bud? You doing good? All right. So, folks, that is going to probably do it for this episode. As you guys can see, we are going to be a very, very busy person here for a while. Until we get some more employees. I mean, we're looking at, I would say, maybe three employees right now would be pretty sufficient. Have one back here, one working the register, and one working the car gas pump but the other issue is guys we're going to run into a situation where we're not going to have coverage all right so realistically you're going to you're talking like six employees but what we're going to do guys i think if we get four that should be good and i can just pick up something i can cover somewhere and not have 24 hour coverage for the time being it's not going to last forever god damn lady scared the crap out of me it's not going to last forever man but our main concern once we do get adequate employees is taking care of this uh, crazy, crazy volcano, making sure our, our shelves are stocked and making sure everything is clean. So with that being said, folks, thank you guys for joining me. I do appreciate it, man. Hope you guys have a great rest of your night and I will see you next time.